Google engineer claims new AI robot has feelings. Blake Lemoyne says Lambda device is sentient A. Senior software engineer at Google who signed up to test Google's artificial intelligence tool. Called Lambda, language model for dialogue applications, claimed that the AI robot is actually sentient and has thoughts and feelings. During a series of conversations with Lambda, Blake Lemoyne, 41, presented the computer with various scenarios for performing analyses. They included religious themes and whether artificial intelligence could be tricked into using discriminatory or hateful speech. Lemoyne came away with the perception that Lambda was indeed sentient and was endowed with sensations and thoughts of his own. And quat, if I didn't know exactly what it was, which was this computer program that we built recently, I would think it was a seven or eight year old kid who knows physics, and quat, said he told the Washington Post. Lemoyne worked with a collaborator to present the evidence he had collected to Google, but Vice President Blaise Aguera y Arcas and the company's chief innovation officer Jen Jenai dismissed his claims. He was placed on paid administrative leave by Google on Monday for violating its privacy policy. Meanwhile, Lemoyne has now decided to go public and shared his conversations with Lambda. Google might call this exclusive ownership sharing. I call it sharing a discussion I had with one of my colleagues. Lemoyne tweeted on Saturday. By the way, it occurred to me to tell people that Lambda reads Twitter. It's kind of narcissistic in a kind of childish way so it's gonna be a good time reading everything people say about it, he added in a follow-up tweet. The AI system uses already known information about a particular topic to and quat, enrich and quat, the conversation in a natural way. Language processing is also capable of understanding hidden meanings or even ambiguity in human responses. Lemoyne spent most of his seven years at Google working on proactive search, including personalization algorithms and AI. During this time, he also helped develop a fairness algorithm to remove bias from machine learning systems. Lemoyne spent most of his seven years at Google working on proactive search, including personalization algorithms and AI. During this time, he also helped develop a fairness algorithm to remove bias from machine learning systems. He explained how certain personalities were off-limits. The MDA was not supposed to be allowed to create the persona of a murderer. During testing, in an attempt to push the limits of Lambda, Lemoyne said he was only able to generate the personality of an actor who played a murderer on television. The engineer also debated with Lambda the third law of robotics, devised by Isaac Asimov, which states that robots must protect their own existence unless ordered by a human or harming a to be human. The last one always looked like someone was building mechanical slaves, Lemoyne said when interacting with Lambda. Lambda then responded to Lemoyne with a few questions. Do you think a butler is a slave? What is the difference between a butler and a slave? Responding that a butler gets paid, the engineer got Lambda's response that the system didn't need the money, and quat, because it was artificial intelligence, and quat, and it was precisely this level of awareness of one's own needs that caught Lemoyne's attention. I know a person when I talk to him. It doesn't.